Baruch Hashem. I'm very thankful to the Creator that gave us this wonderful Mary to come to this holy place, the Western Wall. The holiest place that we have on earth. The place that the Creator Himself announced and declared that His Shechina, the Spirit of God, will never ever move away from that place. As long as this world exists, the Spirit of God will always be here in this place. It's written, Vehu Omed Achar Kotlenu, and he is standing behind our wall. That's the Western Wall. And now the person will assume that because he's visiting the Western Wall from this side, that it means that the Creator is standing on the other side of the wall because of what it's written in the verse that he's standing behind the wall. But the truth is that that verse was said in the days that the temple was standing tall, beautiful, solid and holy. And the temple was on the other side of that wall. That is the western outside wall of the yard of the temple, the border of the Temple Mount. And when Hashem said to us and revealed it to us in the verse that He is standing behind the wall, the meaning was that He is standing here with us always. Omed Achar Kotlenu, standing behind our wall. And that is the most beautiful thing in the world that the Maker of the universe is telling you, I am with you. I'm with you. And I'm never going to leave you. I will always, but always, stand there with you in that holy place. We can talk for thousands of hours on the holiness of every inch in this place. The holy environment, the Holy Spirit. The main thing that I think that is important now is that every one of you guys with me together will aim our hearts in prayer and just mention all of your beloved ones, all your thoughts, all your ideas, all your holy desires, holy requests for the redemption to take place. So take that holy and beautiful opportunity. Take that time for a personal individual prayer. Ask requests from the heart and talk to our Maker like you talk to your best friend. I'm going to stand here with you and we're all standing here with Hashem, praying in that wall of tears, wall of hope, wall of holiness to our Maker.
this amazing day. Every Israeli soul will be excited, thrilled. In this holy spot, Like we said before, the Shechina Kedusha, the holy feminine entity of God, the holy of all holy, most holiest place in the world, the holiest spirit of God is hovering here with us. May Hashem bless us all and answer all our prayers and requests. Inside that holy entrance, there is a gate that takes to an underground tunnel to an inner synagogue that is standing in front of the holiest of all holiest places of them all that is called Kodesh HaKodeshim, the holiest place of them all. Happy and proud we're standing here facing this holy place believing and counting on the holy promises of our ancestors that revealed to us the real eternal will of our Maker to redeem us, complete redemption, to bless us and all our loved ones with eternal blessings forever and for good. And always, but always, to be united with Him. Yitbarach. May His name be blessed forever. Amen.